French tanks are not suitable for counter-attack of Ukraine. A Ukrainian military commander has reportedly raised concerns that light combat tanks supplied to the former Soviet Republic by France aren't suitable for attacks against Russian defense lines because their thin armor can easily be pierced by artillery shells and other weapons. Touted earlier this year by Ukrainian Defense Minister Alexei Reznikov as a sniper rifle on fast wheels, the French AMX-10RC armored fighting vehicle has proven impractical during Kiev's current counter-offensive against Russian forces, Asians France Press reported. One four-man crew has died because of the tank's thin armor, which can easily be pierced by Russian weaponry, a Ukrainian battalion commander told the media outlet. Unfortunately, there was one case when the crew died in the vehicle said the 34-year-old Ukrainian major, whom agency identified only by his call sign Spartanets. There was artillery shelling and a shell exploded near the vehicle. The fragments pierced the armor and the ammunition set detonated. However, Spartanets said the French tanks have proven to be ineffective in front-line assaults. The guns are good, the observation devices are good, but unfortunately there is thin armor and it is impractical to use them in the front line, he said. Just sending out the vehicle so they get destroyed, I consider it is impractical and unnecessary because it's primarily a risk for the crew. The Ukrainian commander added that the AMX-10RCs also has been plagued by breakdowns in their gearboxes, possibly because of their use on dirt roads. Kiev's troops received one month of training in France, which wasn't adequate to master operating the vehicle, he said. The 20-ton AMX-10RC travels on wheels rather than tracks. It was developed in the 1970s for armed reconnaissance and attacks on tanks.